हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू द प्लांट साइंस फोरम इन दिस सीरीज ऑफ टॉक अबाउट सिस्टमेटिक स्टडीज एंड इकोनॉमिक इंपॉर्टेंस ऑफ सम एनजियोस्पर्मी प्लांट फैमिलीज टुडेज टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज यू फोर बी एस सी फ्रॉम मोनोक्लमाइडी दिस इज द सिस्टमेटिक पोजिशन एज पर द बेंथम होकर एंड एंगनो ब्रांड सिस्टम ऑफ क्लासिफिकेशन हियर यू कैन नोट दैट अनलाइक बेंथम एंड होकर एंगलर एंड प्रांटम डजेंट प्रपोज द सीरीज इन कम्प्लीटी There is also another difference. The name given for the taxon subclass is different in both these two system of classification. Bentham and Hooker has proposed monoclamidae, and Angler Bentham proposed archiclamidae as a subclass. The name given for the taxon order is also different. There are a lot more differences than this, but here I have discussed only with respect to this slide. U4 uh, B S C is the fourth largest family of angiosperm. the members of fever we see they are cosmopolitan in distribution that means they are present in every kind of habitat globally about 183 genera and 7300 species are reported in india family u4bac is represented by 60 genera and 350 species there is a lot variation in vegetative as well as floral characters here some of the members of u4bac are shown in images you can note that there is a lot variation in vegetative as well as floral characters now these are some of the common plants from family euphorbiaceae you can correlate the number given on images and the names so there is a, a lot variation now when we discuss vegetative characters as we already said habit shows a great variation and nearly all type of habits are present like herb shrub trees and climbers also as it is a dicot member taproot system is present but some plants also shows a tuberous type of roots stem is aerial erect climbing thick and succulent succulent means a stem which has a water retention capacity as we have said a different types of habit and a lot variation in habitat is there so one of the type is a uh, arid condition where some of the members of euphorbiaceae is also present so in such condition the plant shows succulent type of stem to retain a water in dry arid condition usually they are herbaceous some are woody branch cylindrical angular or flat any kind of shape often it contains a milky latex this is among many important characters of this family euphorbiaceae that some of the members of this family shows a presence of milky latex leaves are stipulate simple phyllotaxy may be alternate or opposite some member shows fleshy and some shows reduced type of leaf and some are palmately in palmately lobed in shape now these are the images for various vegetative characters here Phyllanthus neruri and Euphorbia hirta, they shows a herb type of habit. Euphorbia polychroma shows a shrub type of habit, and here below, Hevia brasiliensis shows tree habit. As dicot member, taproot system is present, and Manioc esculenta it shows a tuberous type of fruits. As I already said, milky latex is present in some of the members. here you can see a milky latex this this image is from hevia brasiliensis tree this milky latex is used for extraction of rubber from it the stem is reduced and the leaves are stem is green and leaves are reduced you can see how it is now the phyllotaxy is alternate and some shows opposite also the shape is also palmately lobed there is a presence of stipule stipule is a leaf like small structure present at the base of petiole now in floral characters family shows a raceme spike and dicagel same type of inflorescence now this is a raceme in raceme inflorescence axis is not terminate and it is indefinite here older flower is present at the base 
and younger is present at the apex in them a spike type of inflorescence is also reported now spike means it is actually a type of raceme but here a pedicel is absent for each flower so flower are directly attached to a floral axis another type of inflorescence is the dicagial cyme as it is a cyme inflorescence axis is terminated by a mature flower and younger flower are present at the base in a genus euphorbia a special type of inflorescence is reported called as scythium in scythium it consists of a single naked female flower and it is a centrally placed which is surrounded by many stamens in a cup like structure gynoecium is a tricarpillary syncarpus that means they are three in number and three are fused so a scythium inflorescence in this a nectary gland is also present as here we have said that a single naked female flower and many stamens which is a male flower is present so it ultimately means that it is a group of flower it is not a single flower as scythium is a group of flower it is a inflorescence not a single flower now let's discuss a floral character flower as you can see in this image it is a very familiar plant the flowers are very minute they are very small they are unisexual either male or female some of the plants are monoecious and some dioecious note that the terminology monoecious and dioecious is utilized for plants whereas unisexual and bisexual hermaphrodite these terms are utilized for flowers so when plant in a plant a flower shows presence of both male and female androecium and gynoecium then it is a bisexual or hermaphrodite flower but in some plants in some plants some flowers are male and some are female but both of them they are present on a same plant body so they are monoecious in another category a male flowers are present on a different plant and female flowers are present on different plant both of them they are on separate plants that's why they are called as dioecious another term is regular regular means from the floral whorls if all the members of the floral whorls they are same alike then it is called as a regular type of flower flower is hypogynous hypogynous means other floral whorls such as sepals petals and androecium they are arising from the base of the ovary and ovary is placed above all of them so flower is hypogynous again note that hypogynous terminology is utilized for flower but in case of gynoecium it is called as superior gynoecium whereas flower is hypogynous as it is a member of monoclomidae the distinction between sepals and petals is not possible you can see such type of flower where distinction is not possible so it is called as perianth and and individual member is a tepal actually this image doesn't belong to family euphorbiaceae but i have shown here as a matter of representation of the character only and androecium androecium is one to many and mostly the numbers of androecium they are equals to perianth root perianth leaves in gynoecium there are three tricarpillary syncarpus and trilocular in each locule one or two ovules may be present gynoecium is superior as we already said flower is gyn- hypogynous that means gynoecium is superior and the axil placentation is present fruit is schizocarpic capsule in resinous a regma type of fruit is present and in imlic officinalis fruit type is droop in bentham and hooker system of classification family euphorbiaceae consist of emblica officinalis but 
as per the recent system of classification emblic of senilis has placed in a different type of family generally seeds are endospermic and oily here you can see a view for cythium inflorescence so these are three gynoecium and they are fused so syncarpus and there are many male flowers pollination is by entomophily here you can see images for insect pollination because of dioecious condition cross pollination is promoted now let's see floral formula for euphorbia male flower calyx corolla absent androecium is one one androecium is a one male flower in case of female flower female symbol calyx corolla absent gynoecium is 3 syncarpus and superior gynoecium hypogynous flower this floral diagram is for euphorbia species whereas for resinous communis flowers are bracteate actinomorphic male five perianth member that is five tepals androecium is also five pin flower is bracteate actinomorphic gynoecium perianth is 3 gynoecium is 3 and fuse syncarpus and hypogynous flower superior ovary this floral diagram is for resinous now in diagnostic feature habit is diverse herb shrub or tree which shows the presence of milky latex simple type of leaf stipule is present they are usually unisexual and the flower is hypogynous gynoecium is superior fruit type is capsule or rigma and cythium inflorescence is also present which is a characteristic feature for euphorbia genus now these are some of the important economic importance hiva brasiliensis is a source of rubber Emilicofficinalis is medicinally very important as well as it is a edible. Resinous communis, Manioc esculenta, and Jatropha carcass. These are other economically important medic medicinal plants. So I hope you understood the topic. If you like the content of this video, please subscribe to the channel. Thank you.